Hey guys, what's up? It's Tombo Tora again. Uh, Ryu Asuna, <laughs> Ryu Asuna and I have, uh, as you can tell, we have been playing uh, Spec Ops Survival on Village, nonetheless. So uh, we're on what wave eleven, and uh, yeah. So this this game is just amazing. I mean, I've I've already seen people like trolling it like really i mean it just came out give give it a give it a little bit of give it a little bit more of a chance i mean because people are comparing it to zombies and yes i know everyone that has played zombies and liked zombies will will be comparing it to that right well i mean i i do it too i i i actually have done it already i'm like well uh these are different uh i like that more than this and blah 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 blah, blah, blah. uh but i mean Really, I love this game mode. I might I might just love it more than zombies, and I am an avid zombie player. I love the shit out of zombies. I mean, I, I, oh, I can't explain how much I love zombies. But this game, mo this, this game mode is amazing. I mean, it holds up to zombie standards, in my opinion. Strictly in my opinion, okay? So, that right there should just stop trolling. Like... It's all a matter of opinion, right? So, don't be a troll. I mean, I'm giving you my opinion, what I think, you know. I mean, maybe you don't like it uh, compared to zombies. And that's perfectly fine. It's cool, it's cool. Don't worry. No one's going to hate you for it. Unless there's trolls in the world. And guess what? There are. <laughs> but, uh... Oh, man, look at that. Look at that mess. <laughs> but, yeah, so... Really, there were only... Th there was w only one big difference between this this gameplay uh spec up survival and zombies and that is spec up survival is faster that is the only thing well and the enemies have guns i mean of course that would be a big hey guess guess what else is different <laughs> oh and they have c4 strapped to them and there's juggernauts and there's airplanes but other than that it's completely like zombies really except you don't get to rape train or anything so really, it's nothing like zombies, because they're not even zombies. But what I'm trying to say is, the entertainment value is exactly the same to me. Uh, I know, like I said, other people, not so much. And I can I can understand that. Maybe, maybe you're, you're just like a hardcore, like the world's biggest, most hardcore zombie player ever. And that's fine. That's perfectly fine. You be that guy. You be that guy, and you own how, you own that. You own how that is. Me? I love the shit out of both of them. Oh, Brad went down. No, Ryu. Ryu, no. I will avenge you, I think. I think I do. Um, yeah, see that car? If I was trying to revive him, I would have died. But his self-revive kicked in, so he uh, he got up himself. Uh, yeah, so I got $11,000, and it's climbing. Oh, no, I'm hurt. Get the cover. Get the cover, Tom Otora. Yeah, you get that kill. Oh, I'm so good at this game. <laughs> oh, oh, kill feed, kill feed. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I'm just, uh, oh, I have an a M4A1 and an AK-47. Uh, I like it. I like it. <laughs> if I had a shotgun instead of the M4A1, that would be even better. But no, I don't have shotguns yet. <laughs> Yeah, so I actually made a a little bubble chart thing, like uh, I don't know, a bubble chart thing. I guess that's what I'm gonna call it. And uh, it it's about the tactics of this game, right? And I'm not gonna go too in depth with it because it's not finished yet. But I pretty much broke down the tactics into early game and late game because really, uh, at at the moment I don't see any mid game here at all. <laughs> But that's that's just right now. I need to I need to play a lot more, man. I need to play a lot more. Don't worry, I am going to, and I'm going to record it, most of it. <laughs> and uh, but yeah, it's about the tactics. Uh, the early game, you just knife, you take the enemy's weapons. Late games, you need airstrikes, you need an LMG, maybe two LMGs if you're really really into it. <laughs> and uh, you need predator missiles, man. Uh, C4 is definitely a, a a need to be there too. Um, but yeah, and then there's, there's two, two ways you can, uh, you can play this game that I see so far. 
and that's holding a position, which is what we're doing. We're just, we localized ourselves into one area. Uh, I'm going to call this the hut area. So we localized ourselves in the hut area, and uh, we're holding that position so that the enemies don't spawn near us. And, uh, oh, he just got a care package, or a perk package, or whatever you want to call it, it a uh, quick draw. But, uh, yeah, so it's either holding a position or running and gunning, which, uh, really, it's the same thing as zombies. I mean, you're either holding a position and rape training, or you're running and gunning through enemies, you know? Oh, yeah, two juggernauts. Great. Awesome. Freaking great. Yeah. Brad's like, come on, run, run, we're not gonna be able to, run, run, we're gonna die, no, no, oh no, oh, we're gonna die, no, I'm like, dude, chill out, I have a predator, I have C4, it's all good, no, no, we're gonna die, we're gonna die, uh, dude, dude, chill out, I have C4 and a predator, it's all good, <laughs> yeah, so, uh, C4 actually kills the juggernauts, so, it's cool, um, I just have to, uh, oh, I didn't even get any hit markers for that, really? He just threw out an airstrike and, uh, yeah, it, it blows shit up. <laughs> big, big blowing up shit. Uh, yeah, so, uh, whenever I get this little bubble chart finished, uh, hopefully it'll be soon. Uh, very, very, very soon, I hope. And, uh, I will give you guys, like, a full layout. I swear I will. So, I'm going to, I'm going to hold off on, on the rest of that just that was a teaser let's let's put it at that but uh yeah so hold on i need to write something down on my bubble chart i just thought of it oh boy it involves claymores just saying just saying <laughs> all right um hostels are inbound we're on wave i can't read that so we're on that wave, uh, whatever wave that is. Uh, it's a new wave. I just made it, made it up, just so you know. Uh, apparently, Brad's saying, "I know, I know, I know." See, here's the weird thing. Uh, whenever I was recording this, it recorded his voice, but not mine. I mean, you would think that it would at least be the other way around because I, I just had my headphones plugged into my PS3, and the uh, Dazzle plugged into. Uh, the laptop and then the RCA cables and a, a bunch of mess and uh, it was recording. Let's just put it at that. But uh, yeah, for some reason it recorded his voice and not mine. So if we could fix that Infinity Ward and Sledgehammer games, that would be a beastly thing to do because then I wouldn't have to uh, uh, commentate over this. I can actually bring it bring into a live. Uh, a live commentary instead of buying another uh, headset because I'd rather not have to buy another headset at the at, at this point in in uh, my YouTube career <laughs> but if I have to I will but I'd rather you guys just uh you know got got my uh, my voice to work in with this just throwing that out there just if anyone wants to uh wants to help me out and just tell them about that that'd be that'd be amazing I appreciate it <laughs> oh, I've been promoted, oh boy! <laughs> yeah, so uh, right now we have a total of uh, three gameplays that I recorded. I completely forgot to record our other gameplay, so that was a uh, completely my fault. I am so sorry, but uh, yeah. So, oh, we're on wait. We just completed wave seventeen. That's awesome. But uh, yeah. So I have a total of three games for you and uh i'm not gonna spoil how many there are <laughs> how many parts there are gonna be of of each so uh, it's a surprise oh boy <laughs> yeah so just setting up some claymores because i can warning the claymores can kill you so can your c4 so can your predator missiles so can your airstrikes just throwing that out there and of course your grenades can just, just throwing that out there. You can get flashed by your own flash grenades. Just letting you guys know. Just so you know that shit can happen accidentally. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it, it's not good sometimes. Like, I almost raged once. I was like, oh, I just died by an explosion. There was no C4. What the hell? And then I remembered, oh, 
I put a ring of claymores around me. Never do that again. Because <laughs> in the, it, with the claymores, it's not like zombies. In zombies, you could set a claymore down, and then you could be right in front of it, and a zombie walks behind you, and it blows up because of the zombie. Well, awesome. I'm still, I, I'm still alive. Not so much in this game. In this game, your claymore's there. If an enemy runs up and it blows up, you both go down and you both die. Not my forte. So I stay away from my claymores when enemies are coming. That's that's just a personal preference, but it's a good idea. I hope you guys take that. <laughs> oh man, fourteen thousand dollars. Oh, I am in business. I don't even. I think that's. I think I have quick draw. Don't know when I got that. I must have been talking. <laughs> uh. Uh, what wave are we on? 18 or 19 or something? Blowing shit up. Oh, it's a good day when shit gets blowed up. Oh, man. Oh, no, doggy. Doggy, get away. Or shoot him in the face. That's cool, too. <laughs> oh, no, I'm hurt. Get to cover, Tobotora. Not that way. Oh, you went the wrong way. Or you got shot. One of them. One of them. Oh, oh. See, if you kill someone, you can actually uh, just revive yourself automatically. R3, R3, there you go, there you go. <laughs> oh, I'm such a beast. Oh, oh, he just threw out an airstrike. That's what an airstrike does. It destroys whatever you are trying to kill, as long as they're in the purple smoke. If they're in the purple smoke, then they die. <laughs> but if they're not, yeah, they don't die. Uh, unless they're, like, right around that purple smoke. Uh, yeah, I, I actually accidentally killed myself with one of those before. It wasn't a, it wasn't a smart move. Just don't be near the purple smoke. It's a bad idea. Bad life choice, guys. <laughs> oh, man. I'll move off my screen. Thank you. <laughs> Something popped up on my screen. Okay, so three juggernauts are coming, right? Shit, man, shit. <laughs> we're like, shit, we're surrounded. Oh, man, we... First off, I want to point out why I would go this way when I would have to run past two juggernauts. Yeah, great idea, man. Great idea. I'm brilliant. Oh, man. Yeah, so he tried to revive me, but he got hit by a juggernaut. So, uh, yeah, that's game, guys.